Hi everybody, it's me Vic. How are you guys doing today? Happy Wednesday. So, this video I wanted to talk about because I recently had a conversation with my brother about this. Dyeing your hair should stop at a certain age. And I thought this would be an interesting topic because I love dyeing my hair. And I dye my hair a lot. I dye it jet black because I've been doing this since I was in my teens, like 19, in my whole 20s. I love jet black hair. My natural hair color is like a dark brown. I don't like that color. I would rather have jet black hair. It's just something about black hair that I love. And I've been doing this for a long time. So my brother, you know, we, we was just talking about we're getting older. He's starting to see little grays in his hair and on his beard. And I too have a very little amount of gray hair because uh, uh, it's hard to really tell because uh, it's, it's just every now and then I get a little something. Like right now my hair... Actually, I just dyed my hair, so you won't be able to see it. No. But I do get little grays, like little ones that comes in the front hair, but um, but it's very little. I don't have a lot of gray hair yet because I guess eventually the older I get, the more gray hair I will have. So uh, my brother was saying, when will I stop dyeing my hair? And I said, uh, I don't know because it's not something that I really think about but it's something that I've been doing I've always been dyeing my hair my hair I dye my hair uh, with I use this one it's jet black just five okay and it's not permanent so it rinses off um, and, you know the more you wash it the more it rinses out and this is what I've been using I do that once in a while I don't really dye my hair as often but when I do, that's the, that's the brand that I use. And it works really good for, for my hair. You see, I just uh, dyed my hair recently. And look how jet black my hair is. My natural hair is doing pretty good, actually. Yes, it's, it's like uh, ever since I started talking about my hair is not growing, I, I'm starting to see that it is growing. Because I right now, I did the banding method to get more, uh, more length in my hair. And you can see that I'm using my blue magic. I'm still at it, the green one. Uh, that's what I've been using. And I've been using my coconut. I you know, I'm doing so many, the coconut deep conditioning treatment. And anyway, what am I talking about? This is not what this video is about. But anyway, I'm just saying that my hair looks healthy. I'm taking really good care of it like I've always been doing. But I've been noticing since I made that video, my hair is starting to uh, flourish even more. But it doesn't really show in this video. But oh my goodness, my, my children are like saying, Mommy, your hair is growing a lot. But it doesn't seem like it to me because it, I don't know. I'm just expecting to have more. But anyway. This is about dyeing the hair. What do you guys think? Do you think that uh, at a certain age you should stop dyeing your hair? You know, what do you guys think about that? Because I think when I reach the age of like 70, 80, I may stop um, dyeing my hair. But I don't know that because I don't, I'm not there yet. So I love dyeing my hair at Jet Black. I do it anyway. I don't think I will stop until I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> because it is what it is but it's kind of weird when you are getting older in a sense like you have all this wrinkly face and you got this jet black hair it looks kind of funny it looks like you're trying to um stay young or you're trying to look young and that doesn't then if that's the case it I, I wouldn't be doing it to look young i do it because of it's a habit for me it's something that i've been doing for such a long time and even if i'm older you know i don't think i will stop and my brother said that I should because of the fact that, you know, as you get older, you shouldn't be dyeing your hair. You have to wear your grays proudly the way that he does. Um, he has very little amount of gray hair, but I know people who are in my age range and they are, they f have full hair of gray. I mean, they're grayed up, like a lot of gray hair. And I'm like, wow, I don't have gray hair like that. I, you know, so it all depends. Hereditary. You know, some people have a lot of gray hair. I knew somebody who was 15 years old who had a lot of gray hair. So it all depends. Just because you have gray hair doesn't mean that you're old. But it identifies with um, getting older. You know, if you're 15 with gray hair, that's hereditary. You know, it, it happens. But it, as you get older, you start reaching the ages of 30 in your 30s, your 40s, your 50s, 60s, and you start seeing the gray hair, I affiliate it with aging because that's what most people who are older, their hair tend to be more gray, you know? 
But the ones that are younger, what does that mean? I believe that the people with gray hair when they're younger, it's just hereditary. It just happens. So, uh, so like I said, I was talking to my brother and he says he's not going to dye his hair. And I said, I am. And I, but I might just dye my hair. I don't know what I'm going to do because I can't think from from now to when I'm 80 or 70. It's I don't know what I'm going to do because I don't know. Because, you know, you, you think, because I may want to go gray next week. I may want to just dye my hair gray or wear a gray wig. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm so indecisive. I don't know what I'm going to do. But as of now, I love me some jet black hair. It's just something that I've been wearing for such a long time that it's going to be weird if I don't dye my hair. I'm just used to it and I love it. And this is who I am. And I've been doing it since I was in my late teens, you know, uh, early 20s and so on and so forth. I, have not, I haven't stopped then. I don't think I will be stopping anytime soon. And again, if I'm in my 80s, that's different. You know, this is something that it's like I, I really started thinking about that. We discussed it and I was like, hmm, I don't know. What do you guys think? You know? Are you guys who have gray hair, do you guys dye your hair or do you wear your grays proudly? You know, let me know. Okay. I just wanted to just talk about that because I find this topic interesting because I am getting to the age where I will be full of gray hair within five, 10 years from now. Who knows? You know what I'm saying? And I don't want to make it look like, oh, she doesn't want to wear her grays because she don't want to look old or don't want to be old. It's not. It got nothing to do with that. It got something we're doing with the fact that I love jet black hair. And I've been wearing my hair black for so long that it would be strange for me to not dye my hair because it's part of my hair regimen. I love to dye my hair. I love it to look black, dark, because it looks healthier to me for some reason. When my hair is in its natural color, which is uh, like a dark brown, and even tend to look a little light brown sometimes, depending. I don't like the way it looks. It looks so dull, you know, as opposed to when I wear jet black. And look at my ponytail. I said my ponytail. Look at my hair right now. It's jet black, as you can see. Jet black, it looks healthy, and it has that shine to the shine to it. But if it was like a brown color to me, it would look good because I love black hair. Okay. But you will see me wearing different colored wigs, you know, because I, you know, it's a wig. So what? It's just fun to just switch it up. But when it comes to my natural hair, you will never see me dye my hair any color other than black because that's what I like. So that's basically it, guys. Tell me what you think. Okay. And take care and God bless. Have a good day. Bye. Take care.